This is Amy Bacon with Spirit Pathways, and I'm here with the August 2020 monthly reading for the sign of Libra. These go with my Monday, every Monday I do a weekly reading for the energy of that week, and then these are the monthly readings for your specific astrology sign. I do these for every sign, so you want to watch your sun sign, your moon sign, and your rising sign. This is the major arcana, and I'm going to choose one card for the overriding energy for you, Libra, for the month of August. And then I'm going to choose more cards. This is the minor arcana and the court cards to give us details for you, Libra, for the month of August. Alright. Alright, so, your major arcana, yay! <laughs> it's the fool, it's the brand new beginning that doesn't pull from the past. This is fantastic energy, Libra, and you're so ready new beginnings, new endeavors, go ahead and take that leap of faith and trust and know you're going to land perfectly. New uncharted course. This doesn't pull from the past. Please stop looking back. This is forward moving only. Brand new energy. Love that for you. All right, let's look at these and get all the details for your month. We're starting with the King of Swords, he's outcomes in business. He's outcomes from using your intellect and your knowledge and your wisdom and all that goodness that you're so comfortable with, Libra. The King of Swords says absolutely use your mind, use your experience, use all your talents for the outcomes that you want. He's uh, the King of Swords. He's all about the intellect and wisdom and experience. He's excellent at business. So very, very good starting right out your new beginning. And this is what they give you. All that. Now, this says we're going to help you come into alignment with your fresh new opportunity. Up here, this little divine hand coming from the divine cloud offering you a brand new opportunity. But if you keep focusing on this, which is the past, which is things that are finished and done and no longer giving you any benefit, you're not going to recognize this. So you've got to stop telling this story. You've got to stop engaging with this. You've got to raise your vibration. You've got to raise your eyes to where you can see the new divine opportunity and you can engage with it and embrace it and enjoy this new opportunity. It's not in the past. It's not something you've done before. So please let that energy go and trust and allow this new exciting energy. Also, this is alignment for you to better honor yourself. Anything that hasn't honored you, that's maybe stabbed you in the back or been unkind or betrayed you, this is walking away from that energy. I know Libra, you want all the justice and you want all the balance, but this Five of Swords says you only have one choice and that's to walk away. So please leave anything that isn't in your highest and best interest. You can't fix these. You know, I know you love to problem solve and I know you want to save people, but that's not your job. They have to figure it out for themselves. You are going to be too busy <laughs> with the Fool and the King of Swords and this amazing brand new opportunity. And the Knight of Wands is all about movement and change and, and, and positive ways. This is the new house you've been waiting for, the new job you've been waiting for, the trip you've been waiting for. The Knight of Wands is on a quest to change things, to bring them in better alignment with what you're excited about. Bring them in better alignment with what inspires you. And this is exactly the movement you need to appreciate this brand new beginning the Fool brings you. And the outcome 
that the King of Swords brings you and the new opportunity here, sitting here. And all of that combines together to give you this Ace of Cups, another beginning. Aces are beginnings. This is the beginning in your spiritual awakening, your spiritual path, a new awakening, a new path. Emotional, beautiful alignment. And also your creative expression. So fantastic. This is like the details and the extra icing on the cake of what this is all about. This brand new beginning that doesn't pull from the past. Put it with that King of Swords to give you the beginning and the outcome and the Knights on a quest. Fantastic month for you this August Libra. Enjoy this. Also, make sure you watch all three videos. The one for your sun sign, the one for your moon sign, the one for your rising sign. And if you're not sure what those are, that my website link is below. Go on the website, go to the contact form, send me your birth date, birth time, birthplace, and I can let you know what all three signs are. Enjoy!